Hi, my name is Eric Chang. This is Joey Ward and Professor Yan Xu from Beihang University and Xu Yun Fan. So today I'm talking about fungal infections. Fungal infections affect more than 1 billion people a year and kills more than 1.5 million people a year worldwide. So it's a very significant healthcare problem. This is a joint project with Peking Union Medical College Hospital, Beihang University, Pfizer, and Microsoft Research. What we want to do is provide a tool in the cloud that allow doctors to help to make a diagnosis on the type of uh, fungal infection. So we're using a deep neural network called bilinear CNN to help to make the classification. With the bilinear CNN, we increase the accuracy from original 78% to 90%. So we are trying to classify uh, among five different classes of fungal infections. And so here's the confusion matrix. You can see that uh, uh, we are enhancing the classification accuracy as we get more data over time. So this is a typical image that may be uploaded to the system to generate the classification result. What we're doing is also providing the activation map that's used by the deep neural net to make the determination. So this is very important because there's a new uh, research called explainable AI. We want to give doctors a way to sort of visualize how the deep neural net is making the decision. This is important so that doctors can see whether the deep neural net is looking at the same features that they were looking at. For example, for this strain of uh, fungal infection, the, uh, the color and the contrast at the bulb area is very important. So you can later see that uh, it's the same feature being used by the deep neural net. So this is another type of uh, fungal infection. So you can see that uh, the system is also extracting all the features that the doctor will be looking at. So after we have trained up this classification algorithm, we can provide the service in the cloud that's reachable to a mo through a mobile phone. And with this mobile phone, you can upload information such as the image that you see under the microscope, plus metadata such as the culture media that's used to grow the, the, uh, the sample, plus the conditions such as temperature. And then the system will provide suggested reference material to look at to help to make a better decision on what type of fungal infection it is. And also the system allows the doctor to provide metadata such as um, additional information about the patient and also the treatment plan and things like that. So when the system uh, provides the reference material, it also provides a gallery. So unlike currently, where the doctor only have a reference book, maybe with two or three images that they can use to look at a particular type of a fungal infection. Now they have a constantly enhanced and enlarging uh, data set that they can look at, plus additional information such as doctors who provide the sample so they can actually consult with other doctors. So we believe that over time, all professionals will use tools such as these, enhanced by AI, to enhance their work so that they can make, make, make better decisions over time. Thank you very much.